Hello everyone, how you guys doing? So What's going on? <laughs> What's the word? So guys, we are two weeks away from going to Texas to drop off our new home. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna take you on a tour of our new mansion for the next... I gotta get the generator going real quick so we have power in there. Uh, yeah. This so. is gonna be our mansion for a year and a half or two years. So as long as we're gonna be building this home, that's where we're gonna live. So let me show you our beautiful yeah. RV. So currently, the RV is covered with the RV cover. Okay, it's a 28 footer. Okay, it's a 28 footer. It's a la launch ultralight Starcraft. Sorry, it's gonna be kind of dark inside because we have that covered. So you're not gonna be probably. No, I think you should be able to see it very well. Let me walk in. So as we walk in, okay. Oh yeah, you can see it very well. Okay, so as we walk in, you guys can see that there is our dining area. Okay. We have our couch. And as you keep on going, that's the only kitchen area that I will have. Legit. There is no space for me. To cook so as you guys know I'm gonna hate every moment of it I already know that I will hate this but there's no choice this is our refrigerator okay and then if you keep on walking there's a bathroom it has separate doors which is pretty cool this is our bathroom vanity our toilet and shower it's currently winterized so there's no water or anything like that and this is a cool part so as you guys see there's two bunk beds and those bunk beds are actually on like a system like a pulley system right here that we can basically move them all the way up like they are right now or we can move them down or whatever we want to do but our plan is to actually completely take those out and I tell you why I have no storage in this place I have no way of keeping any clothes any like anything basically so I'm thinking of doing like a small uh, table in there a table that would hold like a coffee maker and all this stuff and a little bit of our clothes because I really don't have a place to put them besides this this small cabinet that's that's all it is for the storage that's legit all it is um we have a door in here as well so we can oh it's really dark sorry guys um there's a door so we can get inside also from that angle and then if you turn around this is our entertainment center and at the moment this actually pulls out this whole part pulls out, but we have it in because we have a cover on. So it looks very small. It, it, it doesn't make it any much bigger once we, you know, take out the, um, I mean, pull out that, that part. It's still very, very small RV. I don't know how I'm gonna live in this mansion, but I'm gonna have to get used to it. And let me take you to our master. <laughs> master okay so this is our master bedroom so that's another piece of storage that we have for clothes but that's not enough so that's for him and on the other side is for me and then what's cool about it we have a mirror so that spins and that tv that is on the other side can spin and we can watch it watch tv in uh in bed which is nice all those um so this couch is also a sleeper and this is also a sleeper so you put the table down and um, you can make us a bed it's a 28 footer and um, it's very 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 small 
and with the amount of stuff that we have i don't know how we're gonna fit in here but what can i do you know it's a new way of life we gotta do what we gotta do so <clears throat> That's the grand tour of our amazing <laughs> new mansion. Listen, if you want to be debt free and you want to be happy, you got to do what you got to do. And a lot of people does this, does this. They just buy RVs and they live them while they while they building their houses. And that was the right choice for us. So that's what we did. You know, it wasn't expensive. It was a $8,000 um rv and it's actually 2015 like i said 28 footer the cover cost us 200 bucks but we needed the cover because uh i just don't wanted the sun to make it you know looking like crap so we'll keep it covered and after the house is built we're gonna sell this thing back and i'm not gonna look back even a second you know because i'm not very happy to live in this thing but what are we gonna do so honey what you doing oh we did huh right here you see look at this see that so it means it overheated it wasn't connecting very well and then, oh okay and i don't want to have a problem later on so we just ordered a new plug amazon. amazon yep hey stop peeing in your home I'm talking to you. Yes, I'm talking to you. You don't pee on your house. You heard it? So, wish us luck. We're going in two weeks. We're gonna move this thing to Texas and see how that's gonna go. Pulling a 28 footer, we never, we never pulled anything that long. Our other, um, we have two other uh, trailers, enclosed trailers. So this is one. This is 20 footer, and we have most of uh, most of our like furniture and stuff in this. And then here, if you look in here, there is Mikey's car, Mikey's good old blazer, Chevy blazer, and that's another of our enclosed trailers. This this holds um oh Mishek, don't go there this holds all of our tools and and stuff that mikey collected over the years so that's gonna go as a last uh trip including the car car and the uh, trailer Misha, let's go no come on eh. you listen to your mother come let's go let's go let's go let's go 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 son so this is gonna be our second trip, probably a third, because the RV goes as a first, then this one goes as a second. Yeah, this one goes as a second one. Hallmark goes last uh, in September because Hallmark, we're gonna have to stick some more stuff into in it. Uh, we're gonna have to pack up our apartment, our current apartment. So this one will hold all the stuff. So that's our last trip. So you stay tuned you're gonna be with us every moment doing all this crazy stuff so thank you guys for watching make sure that you subscribe stay tuned for more videos